The county high school football coach is speaking out after his team had to forfeit a win over some complimentary restaurant gift cards. Our Bria Chapman joins us live with what the coach says happened about this. Bria. Yeah, that's right, Sarah. So Coach Adam Weingarten says he takes full responsibility for the situation and his players did nothing wrong. Now the school is appealing the AHSAA's decision and Weingarten says this is a learning experience for everyone involved. The whole situation is unfortunate, but like I said, I'm fully confident that everybody's working uh, to make this situation right, not just for us, but for in the future for other people. Adam Weingarten says a part of their culture at Tuscaloosa County High School is to reward students when they do well, and that is what he was doing with his players this season. The many local restaurants have sponsorships with schools, and um, they find ways to, to help support the schools um, through recognition, uh, through feeding kids, through, through lots of things. And uh, so a part of that was Buffalo Wild Wings had given us some complimentary cards to use to uh, recognize students um, and part of the part of that was uh, within our program we were going to do some recognize uh, some different players each week within our program. The Alabama High School Athletic Association says the school broke the amateur rule which states a student is ineligible if he or she received money as a prize. Coach Weingarten says he takes accountability still that punishment was tough on his players. Uh, we had two players that set out at the game uh, um, for because they had participated in the game after they had been recognized. Uh, so we had two players that missed a game, um, and then we had to forfeit a game, and then we also have been fined um, that we have to pay. Weingarten says he didn't have a clear understanding of the rule, but wouldn't do anything to jeopardize his team or players. Everybody wants to do the right thing for kids. Um, the players were did nothing wrong in this situation. There was. There was no money exchanged hands. There was, um, you know, they, they didn't receive anything of monetary value. They got complimentary cars to go get food. Sports is a changing, it's ever changing. Um, and I think I'm confident that everybody's looking at this situation and is going to try to get it corrected, not just for us now, but for in the future. Now, I did reach out to the High School Athletic Association for a comment, and they referred me to their handbook. And Coach Weingarten says the school is not sure how much that fine will be, but the school did share this statement, which says in part, quote, they are disappointed in the ruling, but will ask that the for forfeiture be set aside because of the confusion with the amateur rule. Reporting in Birmingham, I'm Bria Chapman, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.